Hello, 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 hello. Emma, hello, first to comment today. Susan, good evening. Hi, Jitter, hi, Sue. Good evening, Carol. Hi, Chrissy and Nicola. Hello, hello, hello. How is everybody? It's been a really funny week this week. Even though the kids have been at school, I've been so confused on what day is de what day is which. <laughs> but yes, happy Friday. Hello. Have we had a good week? Mine's not been too bad. I think I'm glad it's the weekend. Um, like I said, I've been confused on days, so I, you know, <laughs> it's one of those ones. Good evening, Joanne. Hi, Shelley. Hi, Sue. Hello, hello, hello. Uh, today is a normal live, and I'll just go through everything that um, we've got going on. We do. Oh, bless you, Suzanne. Well, I hope it improves across the weekend, my lovely. Uh, hi, Hayley. I'm glad you're having... Oh, I hope I'm having a great week. Yeah, it's not too bad, thank you. Sue, bless you. Thank you ever so much for the stars there. Okay, so today, um, lots and lots going on. We still have our pineapple pieces which are available and they finish on the 23rd, which is next week. Next Friday they finish. So if you would like to grab a pineapple piece, they finish next Friday. Uh, that's the same with our summer sale that is on the website. That finishes next Friday as well. Um, we also have even more new items popped in the coming soon section on the website so they will be going live on Monday so even more new items on there and they'll all be going live on Monday supporters you have all got a chance to grab one now if you would like to because they're available to you uh, now we also have a lot of stock in the back in sorry I got itchy cheek <laughs> We've got lots of stock in the back in stock section, um, so lots of old favourites are back in stock. So have a lot, have a look, have a look in that section there as well. Um, and then oyster wise, we've still got a few mystery oysters, but I have also just went and opened up a number of the randoms uh, plates again just because obviously to give us that extra and once the mystery's gone my oyster delivery hasn't come whoa nearly spilt them so yeah we do sort of have a few mystery then we've got the randoms until that delivery does come and then just as a reminder we're not live on sunday um but then we are back live to our normal routine from tuesday so i think that's everything pineapple pieces and summer sale live until next Friday. Um, the mystery and uh, random oysters, new stock and stock back in stock as well. Okay, so the order list I have posted on the page. Um, as always, if you have ordered, hopefully you've found whereabouts you are. If you would like to order, there is still space available for today and I'll do an updated order list as we go. So, shall we get started? Hello, 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 Sophie, hello. Okay, so up first today, I've already seen you, so hopefully you're still here. Emma Favel, are you here? Ooh. go flying today sorry just moving my arm up yes oh that's a point the uh, the first batch if you like so the first uh set of stinky oysters were left me today <laughs> um so yeah so, so obviously some people have been ordering stinky oysters and yeah the first ones i've sent out to you guys went today 
so I cannot wait if you guys want to share your videos I cannot wait to see them like I'm so excited <laughs> We do Haley. we've got um, a best friend charm, or we've got a charm which is in like two pieces of best friends as well. Emma, hello. So Emma, you have got one opening altogether. Oh no, excuse me. So sorry, that snuck up on me. So you'd like a random oyster and to donate shells. I'm actually going to leave the plate there just because they all slide around. So I'm just going to dive in. Actually it drips everywhere so it might be it's an idea to to bring that forward <laughs> oh gosh so let's go down so your random oyster donate the shells is there a certain color you're hoping for there's one side and the other side Oh wow, there's no more in that one, wow, 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 now visually these are different sizes here, and they're like a base silver, That's two tonal silver and purple. And that one, I'm just gonna. Yeah, that one's a two tonal oil slick. Just wanted to double check it wasn't reflecting off anything off the screen there. So this one is the visually smaller of the two, and he is a two tonal silver and purple. So it's almost like that mottled tone there. This one has that mottled silverness as well, but as you go round, it does go into an oil slick. So you've got blues, greens, and a larger section of silver and purple on this one with flashes of blues and greens. So twinning, one smaller, one's larger, one's silver and purple, and one's an oil slick. What do you think to these, Emma? The visually smaller and the silver and purple one is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, not a 7.5. He is an 8. And then the visually larger of the two, which is the oil slick, is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, not a 7.5, not an 8. He's an 8.5. So definitely measuring different sizes. just move them around a bit so you can see the colouring with them there as well. What do you think to those? Now again Emma I'll just need to know which one you'd like to have on your jewellery and if you're not happy we can of course swap them for you. Of course we can, let me bring you back up here. So you were going to have the oil slick on there and you'd like to be invoiced for the other one on a lobster fitting. Okay, I've got that down for you. Let me just pop these in here as well. Okay, so Emma, that invoice will get sent across for you over the weekend. And it will go to the email address that's on the order form. Okay, there we go. So you're very, very welcome. And I hope you'll be happy with everything once it arrives. And that's safe up there for you. Okay, up next today is Rachel Scrace. Rachel, are you here? Rachel Scrace, are you here? Mm -hmm. uh, let 
let me save that look at that let me see if I can find the oh there we go perfect Rachel hello now you've got two oysters all together Rachel uh, what two oysters would you like and would you like to keep or would you like to donate your shells? So we've got mystery or we've got the randoms ones. Which two would you like? Oh, Emma. Please do. <laughs> please, please do. I honestly... Like I said before, even if it's only obviously you, your guys' hands with the oyster, or even if it's just the, the, the sound of it and like the phones or the, the cameras pointing at the floor, <laughs> I just can't wait to see your reactions. Random for both, perfect, and donate the shells. So if we just go down, I'll do it a slightly different way. So here's the tray. So. I'm going to pick the two closest to you, so one and two. That way it just doesn't leak all over the desk. Uh, is there certain colours you're hoping for? So random oyster number one. Ooh. There's one side. And the other side and in here you are quadding you are quadding with your first random oyster there's no more in that swim so I'm just going to dry these up for you Okay, so from your first oyster, oh, sorry, just get in the, there we go. So from your first oyster, you have got a candy floss pink. Just going to get that focused, there we go, candy floss pink. A lilac purple, a gold, and a dark two-tonal chocolate and gunmetal. So if you look here, it's gunmetal. As you go around there, it goes into a slight chocolate or very dark chocolate and then back to gunmetal. So, candy floss pink, lilac, gold and chocolate, uh, chocolate gunmetal. So that's from your first oyster. And then moving on to your second oyster. So again, this is from the randoms tray. There's one side. And the other side. Oh, wow. You are quadding for a second time. So two sets of quads, Rachel. There's no more in that swim. Uh, and completely different colours by the looks of it. So again, I'm just going to dry these up and then we'll go through them all for you. Okay, I'm just going to pop them all at the side and we'll go through them as I... So your first one is a sea green and it's a silver sea green so you can see it's silver there and going into a darker sea green. You've got a midnight blue which is slightly two tonal, slight silver section there but most of him is gorgeous deep midnight blue. You've then got this uh, deep chocolate and a brighter watermelon. Okay, so top row, candy floss pink, lilac purple, gold and chocolate gunmetal. And then you've got a sea green, midnight blue, chocolate and a watermelon. Thank you, Barb. Rachel, what do you think to all of these, my lovely? 
Now, if you're happy, we that's perfect. If you're not happy, I can swap them. Your Candy Floss Pink is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, he is a 7. The Lilac Purple is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, uh, he is a 7.5. The Gold is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, he's a 7. And the chocolate gunmetal is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, he's a 7 as well. Sea green is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, he's a 7.5. Midnight blue is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, he's a 7.5. The deep chocolate is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, he's a 7. And last but not least, your watermelon is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7. He's a 7.5. I'd like to change the chocolate for a white, of course. Are you happy with the rest of the colours or would you like to swap any more? I'll hold this one up for you just so you can see if you're happy with that one there. So I've taken away the chocolate here and I've added in that white there. All happy with those? Perfect. I've just taken the chocolate away. So if I bring you back up here, Rachel, I hope you'll be happy with everything once it arrives as well. Uh, thank you ever so much for the donations with your shells there. And that's safe up there for you. Hello, 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 hello. Okay, there we go. Uh, up next then today is Rachel Jones. Rachel, are you here? Rachel Jones, are you here? Uh, hi, Fiona. Hello. Now, Rachel, if you're here, possibly type I'm invisible. It'll bring your comment forward so I can see you. And as always, if anybody can see a Rachel Jones, please comment on her comments because that will bring it forward so I can see. Hello, Tara. Hello. Good evening. I'm well, Samantha. I hope you're well as well. 
Uh, right, last call then for Rachel Jones. If not, we'll move on. Then, of course, if she comes on, we will add her back in again, but it will be to the end of the order list. Okay, I haven't seen her, so we'll move on. And like I say, we'll add her in if she comes back on again. Which means up next then is Anna Mullen. Anna, are you here? Hi Nina, I'm fine, thank you. I hope you're well as well. Oh, let me mark that Rachel's not here yet, but hopefully she can make it on. So Anna Mullen, are you here? Again, if anyone sees Anna, please comment on her comics. That will bring it forward so I can see. Oh, bless you, Linda. It's not a problem. Um, the best way with notifications, guys, I think at the moment, is if you definitely want a notification, even if obviously you can't make it on the live, but you still want to be notified just in case, I think going through our events and saying that you're here and that you're coming to the events is a guaranteed way to get notifications or every time you see a post from us whether it be a picture a video a live anything if you comment on it or like it then Facebook will continuously then show you uh, content from us or from me um, so yeah there's sort of two ways to go about it but yeah it's, it's getting quite hard at the moment Oh, Anna, hello. Oh, bless you. Okay, so I didn't see that one, Anna, until people, people commented. So bear with me, um, but you're here, so that's fine, and I'll just keep my eye out. So, Anna, you have got... We'll do your oyster opening first, and then you've got a pineapple uh, as well. So we'll do that afterwards. So with your oyster opening, Anna, would you like the mystery oysters or one from the randoms tray? And would you like to keep or would you like to donate your shells? Oh, bless you, Hayley. Let me just see if I can have a quick... Um, what would it be under? I'm just having a quick look for this charm. Uh, that's a big sister one. Uh, sorry, I've just come away from, from the comments for just a moment. I do have some in stock so if it's not on the website I do apologize but I'm just going through all of the charms quickly <gasps> okay so it's not on the website so if you would like to see photos of it pop me an email over and I'll send you some photos of the ones I've got um, and then I'll let you know the price as well and then if you'd like to purchase um i'll pop them on the website so yeah i don't know why they're not on the website but i do have some in my lovely so yeah pop me an email over and i'll send you some photos if that's okay linda bless you thank you for the stars and anna can you have a random and donate of course you can so let's go down random oyster we're going to go for that one there got your notification today for stinky oysters oh tara if you're videoing it please 
um, if you feel comfortable to, share it in the Pearls of Brecon group. I'd love to see everyone's reactions. <laughs> Obviously, don't if you don't want to, but yeah, if you do, I'd love to see it. Now, Anna, donating the shells, is there a certain colour that you're hoping for at all? There's one side. And the other side. And Anna, you are quadding. Uh, third set of quads for tonight so far. There's no more in that one. You was hoping for a light colour. Okay, so here you've got three lighter shades. And then you do have a darker shade there as well. So let me just clean these up. And then we'll go through and you can have a look and see if any of these are okay for your jewellery. So I'm just cleaning each pearl individually because they're a little bit mucky. Okay, so again I'm going to pop them all in the sand and then I'll go through them. Your first one, now this is a two-tonal rosy gold gold. So if you can see here, it is gold, but it's also got that rose gold tone to him. He is also lighter and darker there. So rosy gold, gold for your first one. You then have got a two-tonal candy floss pink, so lighter and darker areas. You've got a lilac purple. And then last but not least, you have got an oil slick. So this oil slick, if you can see here, is darker and then as you go round purple there, green and blue. Wow, 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 wow. Okay, what do you think to these, Anna? Again, if you're happy, I'll just need to know which one you'd like to go on your jewellery. If you're not happy, we can swap them for you. So you've got your rosy gold gold, two tonal candy floss pink, a lilac purple and a oil slick. If I run them through the board, your gold is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, he's a 7. Candy floss pink is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, he's a 7. The lilac is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, he's a 7. And the oil slick is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, he's a 7 as well. Oh, swap the rose gold for a darker creamy pearl. For a darker creamy pearl. Do you mean like... That kind of colour. Do you mean one like that? That's perfect. Okay. Which colour would you like on your jewellery? I'm just going to bring you back up here. Cream on that, perfect. So we'll have cream on that and then the other ones can go in here. Uh, yeah, that measuring board is the one that my dad uh, made me. I have had other measuring boards since then. I've got the electric ones, but I don't like using that one um, and then I have had to send some ones that I got made for me back because they weren't correct but that one is still the one that my dad made me yes 
Uh, right, Anna, you have also then got a pineapple pieces. Now, you don't have an oyster opening with this one, so I'll need to know, would you like pineapple number one or pineapple number two? What do you think? number one okay so if we go straight down parcel number one let's get him open okay so anna we'll start with your silver one and your silver charm is the Bumblebee charm. There we go. So here is your bumblebee. I'm just going to show you the reverse side of this one. So it doesn't have the detailing on this side, but it does still look like he's got detailing on him. So going back to the front, you can see that he's got his wings, his little legs at the front, and then his two sections with the body. So that's your silver charm to choose from and that is the bumblebee and then your crystal charm is the sunspot charm so this has got the point on one side and this is in that gorgeous lighter green show you against the darkness of the glove as well okay so i will need to know anna which one you would like to keep so your silver option is this one. And then your crystal option is this one. Oh, bless you, Becky. That's so very kind of you. And thank you for supporting my lovely. Can you have the B? Of course you can. Okay, so let me just pop the green crystal back over there. And the B is yours. And let me just pop this on here as well okay so thank you everybody who's commenting on Anna's comments there and I don't know why some comments are coming through and others aren't but I hope I haven't missed anything that you've said at all um thank you ever so much Anna for the donations with your shells and I do hope that you'll be happy with everything once it arrives my lovely and that's safe up there for you oh bless you Anna you're very very welcome Top up the pineapple. Okay. <laughs> um, and up next today is Carol Grant. Carol, are you here? Um, if anybody would like to order for this evening, there is space available, but do let me know before you order, just because I wouldn't want to end the live um, if you went to order, sort of thing, because we're near the end of the order list now. Rachel, not a problem. I'm going to add you back into the end of the order list, Rachel. Okay, perfect. And Carol, hello. So one random, one mystery, donate the shells. So you do have two openings all together. Uh, we'll open up the oysters first and then I'll show you your jewellery afterwards, Carol, if that's okay. I have got it here. Um, I found the safe place. It was a very safe, safe place. And when I found it, it made sense that why it was that. <laughs> so one mystery and one uh, random oh Becky that's so very kind of you thank you my lovely very kind thank you 
I'm just going to grab one of those. Um, okay, so we'll open up your mystery oyster first. It's a pumpkin. <laughs> oh, it's almost pumpkin season in the office. Almost. Right, mystery oyster in here. There's your mother of pearl. And in here, you are twinning. Oh, there's one and two. No more in that one. Twinning with a darker grape. Sorry about that. Darker grape purple twins. Uh, now, one purple does look like he's slightly darker than his twin. You can see the one on this side is the darker of the two. Um, there we go. So twinning great purples to start with. Then moving on to your random oyster. There's one side and the other side. Oh, you are twinning. There's no more in that one. And you're twinning with two completely different shades. I mean, they complement each other beautifully. You've got a brighter grape purple and then a darker watermelon as well. Look at those. So twinning in both your mystery and your random oyster. Mystery is twinning dark grape purples, one which is slightly darker than the other. And then the front two are twinning from the randoms uh, tray. And one is a bright great purple, and then you've got that gorgeous dark watermelon as well. It's extremely unusual, Linda. Now, Carol, what do you think to the colours? If you're happy, of course that's perfect. Again, if you're not happy, we can swap them. The darker of the purple twins is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, he's a 6.5. Slightly lighter of the purple twins is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6. He's a 6.5. The brighter great purple is not a 5, not a 5.5. Ooh, he's a runaway. Not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7. He's a 7.5. And your watermelon is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6. Not a 6.5. He is a 7. Will I let Linda and Jitta pick the colours, as in to which ones you would like to go wear, Carol, or just which two you would like on the jewellery, and then I make it put as a surprise for you. They really are Sue, aren't they? They're gorgeous together there. Which ones go on which items of jewellery? 
So would you like me to say the jewellery that you've got? And obviously I can show you one of them and then you'd like me to say the other one. So what I'm going to do is the colours are still here, but I'm just going to show you your item of jewellery first. Just taking the staple out here. See, I even labelled this cross for Carol. <laughs> so I definitely wouldn't pop it. Oh, I didn't. Um, let me hold it on here. Okay, so this is the pendant. Okay, so... This is a cross. Now with this cross, if I just slowly move it around, you've got this almost like a piece of twine or a piece of bark entwined all around the cross. So it is a 3D piece, it goes all the way around. So it starts uh, under this section here and then it loops. So it starts here, comes around the front loops round the back and then entwines and goes down the cross there. I hope you're happy with this Carol. So this piece you guys are not going to be able to find on the website because Carol requested um, an item of jewellery that was uh, designed so this is an item of jewellery which is her request and I'm hoping that that is okay and you're happy with that one my lovely so again it starts here so if I just turn it round comes round the front loops round here loops all the way around and then goes round the bottom there So I hope you're happy with that. So we're going to need to know which colour pearl would like on that item. Okay, and then your other item is a bracelet. So I'll need to know which colour pearl goes on your bracelet as well. I'm glad you guys are all liking it. And Carol, of course, you're the most. I'm glad you like it <laughs> as it is your item. Pearl wise. Uh, Linda and. Was it Jutta? Let me just go back up. Carol would like you guys to choose which of the colours go on which item. So she's got her bracelet and she's got that cross pendant. Which colour do you think should go on which item? Darker second twin. You still vote for the darker second twin. So Linda, you vote for this one here. Okay, so if I pop that one down the front, and then you've got these three, so you've got a darker uh, grape purple, slightly lighter grape purple, and then you've got a darker watermelon. Uh, the cross that cross isn't going on the website christine no uh, we do have other designs on there um if that helps but that one won't be
So we're picking that purple for the cross. Are you happy with that one, Carol? For that one to go on the cross. Then we just need one of these for the bracelet. Happy of that one, perfect. Oh, bless you, Linda. <laughs> uh, just so you think the grape purple on the bracelet. Do you have a preference with the lighter or the darker one? So I'll just move them in front. So that one there is the darker one. And then that one there's the lighter one. So there's not a lot in it, but there is a slight colour change. I'm fine, thank you, Samantha. I hope you're well as well. The lighter one, okay, perfect. Carol, just confirm for me, are you happy then with that lighter grape purple on your bracelet, my lovely? Oh, sorry, went off screen there. So there he is there. I'm just going to bring you up. So I can write this down. The new Pinoco. Oh, is it good, Samantha? I haven't seen it yet. And the others on hoop fittings not a problem okay so let me just write all this down so we've got that brighter grape on the pendant then the lighter twin grape on the bracelet and then you'd like to be invoiced for the other two on hoop fittings perfect i've got that down for you carol uh, the invoice will get sent across for you over the weekend it'll go to the email address that's on the order form uh, thank you ever so much for the donations of your shells and again i'm happy that you're happy with that cross pendant there okay and that's safe up there for you oh blessed <laughs> blessing samantha Okay, and up next today is Rachel Jones. Rachel, are you here? Oh, you're very welcome, Carol. Not a problem at all. Oh, did anybody see the images I posted earlier? So what I've done is I've posted a couple of um, orders that we've been packaging up as we go. So just sort of not saying who the order's going to, but I have popped the order numbers on there just in case that person wants to be like, oh, that one was my one. <laughs> um, and one of the blues on the, where is it? On the yellow bellied seahorse charm if you guys see it, it's the most recent one. It was posted five hours ago. The blue on that charm is gorgeous. Like it looks even more, uh, it looks more like a sea blue 
on in that lighting uh, compared to when we opened it on the live it is beautiful i was just wondering if anybody else had seen it you saw them lisa it's just have you seen the color it's just crazy uh rachel hello my lovely oh <clears throat> excuse me rachel you have got uh one opening altogether mystery oyster and donate your shells is there a certain colour that you're hoping for? So if we go down your mystery oyster, you've got a lighter double pop there. Uh, there's a little bit of flesh on that side, but we can see that there's no pearls there at all. I can see, however, Rachel, you are twinning. And you're twinning with gold pearls here. There's no more in that one. Let me dry these up for you. What do you think to those? If I run them through the board for you, Rachel, your gold number one is not a five, not a 5.5, not a six, not a 6.5, not a seven, he's a 7.5. Gold number two is not a five, not a 5.5, not a six, not a 6.5, not a seven. He's also a 7.5, so they are measuring the same size there. Now, Rachel, if you're happy with these, that's perfect, and I can pop one of them on the jewellery for you. If you're not happy, we can swap them for you, the one or both of them, but then again, I will just need to know which ones you'd like to have on the jewellery. What do you think? Yes, Linda. Um, I don't think yours were sent today. I think they're getting sent in the next postal run. But I remember closing them. <laughs> Any on the jewellery, Rachel? Perfect. Let me bring you back up and I can write that down. So we're going to have gold on there. And then let me pop these in here for you. I'm glad you're happy with the shade there. There we go, that's safe on there for you. And then that's safe up there. Uh, so Rachel, thank you ever so much for the donations with your shells. And I do hope that you'll be happy with everything once it arrives as well. You're very, very welcome. Oh, thank you, Bev. But Aaron's just popping the fan off, taking the fan off. Thank you very much. Uh, right, let me have a look here. Ooh. That's possibly the end of the order list today. Oh, before you go, let me just say, so I did say at the start of the live, the first load, if you like, so the first um, orders of the Stinky Oysters went out today. Um, if you ordered them, you're potentially getting them tomorrow. Uh, some people obviously will be, the post will take slightly longer. 
um, and if you video it and you don't mind sharing please pop it in the Pearls of Brecon group because we'd, I'm sure we'd all love to see um, what they're like and if anybody would like to uh, venture and try to open a stinky oyster at home uh, they come with a pair of gloves and they come with a little code where you can scan it takes you to a video where I just briefly explain how to open oysters um, like in more detail just in case um, so yeah they're on the website for £6.50 I believe um, <laughs> if you'd like to give that a shot um, apart from that I think we are finished for the evening let me just refresh this over here perfect okay so we as a reminder we're not live on Sunday so I did say last week that we won't be going live on Sunday um, just because it is the day before the um, Queen's funeral so in respect we're having that live off um, but then from Tuesday we'll be back to normal okay so I hope you'll have a brilliant weekend um, and I'll see you on Tuesday take care bye